life giver, destiny changer, Jehovah, you know they use me play, oh, life giver, destiny helper, Jehovah, you know they use me play, beautiful people my name is Annie Banks welcome back to my YouTube channel I want to use this opportunity to say thank you to those that have subscribed to my channel I thank you I appreciate you I do not take your clicking the subscription button for granted I say thank you and if you are new to my channel you have not subscribed you have not liked and those that have liked please what actually makes a difference is you subscribing for me to reach the 1000 subscription subscription um, 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 goal for me to be able to earn on YouTube but really it's not about me earning on YouTube it's about me sharing content It's about me promoting the African con uh, continent in a positive way i'm joining my brother from ghana wadimaya you know i'm following his full step promoting africa to those in diaspora promoting africa i mean nigeria promoting nigeria to you know to the continent to the african continent and to the world so i say um if you have subscribed i say thank you i really appreciate you for doing that please share to your friends to your family i know recommend me and also your suggestion and your comment is valuable so good morning as i said earlier my name is annie banks on youtube and today mm, what are we going to be discussing today say thank god it's friday if you're one of those that says thank god it's friday that you're waiting for friday before you rejoice and before you are happy hmm you know um i watch big brother africa there's this guy called michael that came from the abroad that represented nigeria in uh, one of the you know in uh, one of the sporting competition he is a married man can you imagine a married man came to big brother nigeria house married you know and then um, the wife was expecting a baby but there's this word he said that i took and i held on to you might be saying uh -uh. Hmm, agatha is watching big brother yes i watch big brother but that has, has that has not changed my values that has not changed what i believe in it has not changed who i am if you know since they started big brother i've been watching big brother since they started big brother you know uh, so today i'll be talking about big brother he said this word this is what he said he said don't count each day but make each day count hmm. think about that you might be saying i've heard that word before you know sometimes you've heard some words but they don't hit home but someone says it and it resonates with you someone <laughs> someone says it and it resonates with you sorry for that uh, okay so let me introduce myself so that you know me better <laughs> i'm a fashion entrepreneur um a mother of two beautiful handsome boys yes hmm. and uh, my youtube channel will be dedicated to you know encouraging parents uh, most especially encouraging single parents and also i will be talking about fashion sometimes because that's my line of that's my sector you know fashion i'm a fashion entrepreneur fashion i do anything fashion i make clothes ready to wear i sell ready to wear of all the brands you know there's nothing that i've not done one of these days i'll be talking about business see there is nothing that you cannot do see try your hands on everything anything because you don't know what would click for you you don't know that which will be successful so back to my to my discussion so i'm a parent and i also live in africa i live in nigeria specifically 
and you know no matter how we decide to block our ears no matter how we decide to be immune to what is happening in our society see it affects us one way or the other we can say that oh you don't want your children to watch big brother you don't want um, your children but you know what whether we accept it or not big brother has come to stay and there are some other content that might not agree with your religion that is still coming so why don't we take the time just as the word of god says train up a child in the way that he should go when he is old he will not depart from it what you have control over is to train so why don't you train your child train your child in the values that you want them to inculcate train them in the character building them the character that you want them to grow with you know uh during the week i saw something on facebook hmm. i told myself i wanted to make a video on this big brother for one time and i just changed my mind you know things like that but like um was it yesterday or two days ago i was going through my facebook and i saw somebody posted something about big brother and i'm also a christian yes a christian i'm not a church goer i'm a christian i'm not a religious person i'm trying to be spiritual also so talking about big brother nudeness talking about um weakening your moral um moral stand and it corrupts your soul mm -hmm. i don't have an issue with that what i have an issue with is why don't we start concentrating on the things we have control over you have control over the values that you teach your children you have control over how you bring up your children you know what big brother is like a mini university when you have trained up your children maybe they didn't go to boarding house you, they, they attended um, what's it called primary secondary school there is now time for them to go to university when they go to say you send them for to university you are not there to watch over them and you don't know what is happening in the university campus people walk naked you find nude people nude girls nude people crazy people you go to the beach you find people wearing bikini Will you say when you go to the beach, you close the eyes of your children? No. Will you say when you, they go to the university, they close their eyes when they are walking? No. So Big Brother has come to stay. It is the value that you have put in your children. It is the character that you have built in them that will make them stand irrespective of whatever situation they find themselves, irrespective of whatever environment that they find themselves see let's not deceive ourselves there are more nude, uh, uh, nudeness and nakedness that are yet to come so your own that you have con you don't have control over big brother you might say send a petition that they should ban them from the tv station nobody has control over social media have you thought of that can you tell them to ban the social media the facebook the instagram and right now you don't have control over what you watch immediately you own you are on onto your social media videos just come up automatically on their own so why don't you as i said i've been watching big brother since they started big brother yes i choose and you know when you have trained up your children they choose what even when they are watching they choose when to block off some things that does not um that does not um that does not uh, um that is not um in line with their values if you know me if you've known me for years you will know that my character has not changed the values that i hold on to has not changed and my person has not changed and the person the standard that i hold has not changed so i've been watching big brother yes i am a christian yes i'm a christian do i sleep around no do i dress naked no i'm a very conservative introverted person so you know what what has kept me the values that my parents has taught me so that you will not always be with your children you will not always be with them but the value that you have taught them 
the character that you have built with them will make them stand so why don't we start pushing values pushing building our children see as those children are getting pregnant do you know T.D. Jakes, the popular T.D. Jakes? His daughter got pregnant. But thank God now, he's, um, you know, teaching teenagers, you know, you know, pushing, teaching them values and all that. You know, she's growing the ministry. See, do you know the rate of unemployment? Do you know the rate of unemployment? We'll talk about that someday. And do you know how much is the giveaway price for the Big Brother winner? Hmm. 90 million. Have you seen 90 million before? Have you even seen 1 million? You might have seen 1 million, but have you seen 90 million with a car? You know, with endorsements. Why don't we see? Let's stop running away from things. Big Brother and other things happening in the world is like politics. Christians running away from politics. And you say there are a lot of bad people there. If there are bad people there and you are running away from me as a Christian or as a value person, see, those bad people, those things that they will be the one making policies that affect your life, affect your business, and affect your children. So why don't we start going into those places that we say they are bad and start making a change and start pushing our values? Do you know that if your child wins that 90 million naira your child a christian spirit born feelings feel do you know what that 90 million naira will do to pushing the ministry of god see god owns the money irrespective if the devil has a hold over it why not let us go into these industries into all these platforms that were created let's assume you might assume is the, the platform was created by devil why not let us go into those platforms win the money and push the right value money see devil did not create the money god has said he owns everything who the devil he owns the devil so why don't you go allow your children take a share of the money and let's build values take a share of the money let's spread the gospel and let's stop pretending let's stop living in denial let's stop making our children you know fearful to try things because that is why we have a lot of ch some children masturbating that's why we have some children trying to uh, um, experiment things why would you think a pastor's wife would, a pastor's um, child will get pregnant some, some are involved in pornography. But you know what? The word of God says, a believer, you fall seven times and you rise up seven, seven times or how it's been said. Meaning that you are going to fall. But because of the value that you have planted, the seed of the value you have planted in them, when that time comes, when they fall, they know how to retrace back their step and go through the right path. Allow them to fail. Allow them to fall. Mas, um, John Maxwell says failing forward. That means you have to accept failure and accept it as part of life. See, let's not start, um, let's encourage our children if they want to join the big brother. But you know what? having in your mind rest of mind that the value that you have put in them will keep them going then they will go and they will make your name proud you know what um let's each one teach one and let's make our continent a great nation let's each one teach one there will be someday will not be there for your children but that which is more than money that you have planted in them, that you have grown them with, will keep them going, will keep them running. There's this lady that was a pastor's um, daughter, Debbie Rice, one of those episodes of Big Brother that was in the house. They did this true or dare game, and she was asked to do some crazy things. But you know what? 
she did not she chose not to because of the value that her parents has put in her she might not have won the winner prize but she used that platform to promote herself the little that she got made a difference in her life so it means a pastor's child can attend big brother but you know the value that you that the 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 character that is built in that child you know will make the child choose what is right over what is wrong will make the child choose what to do make a decision have a mind of his own or her own to take the right decision i leave you with this piece i'm still watching big brother i'm still coming your way to share more value see i watch it if you if you train up your your child in the way that they should go they will watch some things and they will know when to tune off they will watch some things instead of some people just watching it and it's just purely entertainment they will watch it and they will pick lessons from it there are lessons to learn in what is happening it's not only bad there are lessons to to learn it's also about human relationship when you leave human beings enclosed in an environment it also brings out character do you remember tasha it brings out the character in you it also shows you what you can handle it reveals to you what you are can handle when you are under pressure so let's give our children a chance let's start focusing on what we have control over there are lots of things we have control over let's start you know working on that what we have control over and that which we don't have control over let's leave it to god and let's start pushing posit uh, positivity i say thank you for watching my channel and please subscribe to my channel like share to friends and family you know let's each one build one what a great continent that we will have and what a great world and nation that we will have and i ask you yes you are my brother you are my sister i say i might not like you but i love you with the love of god i might not like you but i love you with the love of god i have a love for africa i have a love for small businesses i have a love for parenting because i have two boys and i must raise them in the way that they should go because i will not be there every day and every time i am not the holy spirit i am a human being i can only be in one place part time and i ask you also to comment to suggest what you need me to talk about what you need us to you know um explore i ask you you know to suggest to comment and my friends and family that has been liking and has been encouraging me i say thank you thank you thank you am i looking good this morning yeah one of those things i will share how to start you know a business just having little or no capital look you know look out for that and keep watching my youtube channel click the subscribe button like please like 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 you no know, god loves you god loves you like 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 you know i'm here your humble wealthy and the banks you know see you in my next video and see more of you all the parents subscribe to my channel all the entrepreneurs subscribe to my channel all the african lovers subscribe to my channel all the wadimaya my west african ghana brother subscribe to my channel miss trudy my mom loves you like like no man's business so wadimaya my brother don't disappoint my mom hmm. or else miss trudy enjoy yourself and have a great day and remember to subscribe remember let us not be ignorant of what is happening around us thank you love you